Bro, nah, yo, you know what? You be lying. What's good, man? We back, on back, on back, on back, on. Whoa! Oh my gosh! Whoa! What's good, man? We back, on TT. <laughs> If it's your first time, man, death won't be your last. Make sure you kill murder and smash that subscribe button, man. And welcome back to RTTV Reacts, where we react to everything. Every day. And the Halloween marathon continues, yo. Woo! We got one of the scariest movies of 2012. I I just knew when it came out that people were saying it was oh, scary. Eat the Hawk is on it. The cover got mad blood on it. Oh, what y'all expecting? I'm expecting to be scared. I'm expecting to like have nightmares. Yeah, I just scared. It was good. It's freaking spooky season, bro. Mm -hmm. I want to be scared all through the month of October. Okay. So Patrick, I hope this movie is the scariest movie that we see this month. You gotta wake up at three in the morning feeling like you're possessed. I want to wake up at three in the morning and go. Ah! Joel and Taylor are gonna be used to some Muriel. <laughs> yeah, 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 I ain't gonna front. See, the worst thing about it is when I wake up in my bed, if I like just sit up, mm -hmm. like you know how like the closet got a mirror on it. Mm. My, anytime I watch a scary movie, if I'm actually scared, I'd be like, I'm not looking in the mirror, nigga. It's gonna be, it's gonna be one of them dumbass apparitions in the fucking mirror. <laughs> you got a bed in your room? Yeah. Why is that so shocking? In your closet? Yeah. Oh. Why is that shocking? Like from my bed, I can see the mirror of my, uh, my, uh, what do you call it, closet? Yeah. So I wake up and I be like, yo, imagine there's a reflection right behind me. It's yeah, like that's like the shit I can I think. Mean, like three in the morning, bro, I be like, damn, yo, I shouldn't have watched that shit yesterday. Yo. <laughs> Sometimes my clothes is open, so I be thinking that something's gonna pop out of my clothes. <laughs> <laughs> but yo, if y'all want to catch some full and uncut reactions of the whole Halloween marathon, also we got MCU movies, also we got Harry Potter and a lot more. Check out Patreon, man. The link is right down below. But let's get into this movie right here. Sinister. Bloody Mary. What the oh, hell? Wow, that's how you have a little bit of 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 a it's a scary movie. That a little bit of 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 a at least they put some yeah. Jerry's like, at least they put some pizzazz on that shit. Like, what? You must love Saw. Yeah. You know how creative that is. Huh? It really came out coming out with another one. It's Saw out, yeah. Isn't it out right now? Yeah, I heard it. I want to go see it. Eureka. Why can't you keep writing in the old house? Because I was going to have to write college textbooks to pay for that old house. house. I don't want to be here. I can't do that. Carry boxes. Tuition. Back in. I just can't. What? I miss my school. All right. You know what? School here is supposed to be pretty great. I'm tired of driving five miles. That little girl weekend. looks scary. I ain't gonna look at her. Yeah, right? She look like a nice. possessed doll that came to life. She look like a naked. Is there a problem? No, sir. Just a friendly visit. I appreciate that. That was a nice one. I know who you are. Bro, Damn. shake my hand, bro. <laughs> Say you're not a fan. Like, what do you know? Cold Ember Morning, you got it wrong. Blood Diner? Yeah, that wasn't my fault. Right. Your bad theory, you have to kill or go free. You ruined oh, so he actually life. writes about all kinds of things. It needs to, it needs to heal. It needs to forget. And you sure don't want that circus that you bring with you. Well, there's a missing girl involved here. She ain't missing. She's dead. Come on. You don't know that. Brian moving in no way where I got people to police. Yeah, bro, what? Oh, yeah, I'm black. Bro. What was all that about? <laughs> <That's> <laughs> Surprise, <laughs> buddy. You still got beef. <laughs> That bad. <laughs> Why are you the playing at the house? <laughs> Ellison, we didn't move in a few houses down from a crime scene again, did we? Oh, Just no. Nah. No. If we did, I don't want to know about it. Nah, it's Whoa. the place where it actually happened. It's the place where it happened. Yeah. That's even what? No, so he didn't lie to. Nah, that's he why. He moved his family into the crib that he's investigating. <laughs> That's wild. That's not. That's why he said this. No, nah, but that's not the crib. But that's not what he's investigating. He's investigating a missing girl. Is the story a good one this time? Yeah, it's good. Of course it is. Can we take me and show me where it happened. Uh, 
the fucking film. Wow. Oh, that's what you get when I'm recording it, you clown. Oh my god. You better have a new one. Nah, he's supposed to record it on a phone or something like that. Yeah, right, yeah, you're right. Go to your room, Chubba, and I don't want to see you again until dinner. Hey, oh. hey, 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 what happened? Mom's overreacting. Your son is acting out again. All right, what did he do? Oh, so you're automatically taking hey, her stop side? Stop it. What did you do? He drew a picture. He drew a picture with a permanent marker on the classroom whiteboard. Oh, Tell really? him what you drew. I drew a tree. With four people hanging from it. Go to your room, Chubba. Does he even know about it? Mother. Or did he wow. see that in his office? That's the, that's the bigger question. At school, Ellison. Sounds in this year are like eerie as hell. Yeah. Shit. Oh, shit, that little chihuahua scared me for a second. Look at you. Yeah, Joel. Yeah, Wells. That's very beautiful. Man. Oh, that's cool how they did it off his lens. Hey, you know this dude don't care about solving these crimes, bro, because at that point, he would have just got the cops involved. Yo, that'd be crazy if all the situations was the kids doing it. Yeah, brother, his son was in the box of somebody to kill his family. His son's playing hanging people. <laughs> nah, you got to be honest. Yo, Joel's water flu right there, yo. <laughs> that was a joke. Yo, jo I, 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 I jumped over. Yo, I actually you know, did it. Yeah, you did it. Scary if I could see. Yeah. <laughs> like what? Yeah, shit. Bro, all I see is a light in a black screen, bro. page in your books where you always say nice things about all the people that helped you out the acknowledgments yeah well oh, you you that the hell? I, you know i could be like that guy you know your deputy so-and-so you know i mean if you don't already have one yeah 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 there are a few things you actually do need really. you know, yeah, 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 right. Right. do you have a notepad that's grizzly content fame and money <laughs> no i'm just kidding Boy, there's, there's, watching there's glory days in kentucky, kentucky blood uh, I'm really driven by a sense of injustice. Uh, you know, when I think about the awful things that happened to these people and that those responsible were never even identified, let alone caught. So ultimately, what feels better? Seeing justice done or seeing your, your book, Kentucky Blood, number one, on the New York Times bestseller list? The justice. Cap! Cap! I'd rather cut my hands off. Cap! Book for fame or money. I'd rather oh. cut my hands off. Shut your lying ass. You know what's crazy? He might have felt that way at right that time. Yeah, I guess. But you. now it's it's flipped. Mr. Oh, Boone. he's trying to look at where they're saying he was. Yeah, she was or whatever it is. Imagine it's the ghost trying to help him identify who Mr. Boogie is. Hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's why they draw they drew this up. Mr. Boogie? Yeah, see? Looks like an older man, right? Or is that a map? Oh, I'm not. Can I make you daddy's coffee? Yes. Can I help? I want to bring it to him. Sure, honey. But we have to make it just right. Wait, what? Oh! oh! You don't see this shit moving on the moving. screen, Rob? I just see Oh, that, that was kind of scary. I ain't yeah. going front. <laughs> Bro, did you hear what he said, though? Yeah, he said that they, they lived in that house before they moved here, right? Yeah. You know what's crazy? So it must be the kids that went missing that's doing it. Dog, and this, that ain't enough for you to leave that goddamn house, bro. <laughs> At this point, son. It's a barter, bro. He I man, you be that. You be that when you get smoked out your boots. Or your or your kids, all that. 
He'd be the most battered ass person. Way worse than it was. I just. Whoa! Whoa! The dog isn't growling at you, it's growling at the ghost. The dog eats the ghost. Yo, you think your dog is a ghost? Yeah, they do say that dogs like. They all they say that about dogs. Yeah, fine. Who is that? I don't know. I'm hoping to find out. You think these are serial murders? Maybe. More ritualized than necessarily serial, but really spread out, and not just regional. Right, over time. Like the 1960s? The 1960s? Yeah. 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 Okay. I like it. We got a squad yeah. now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. why well, And then we're gonna get the professors three versus the, the demons. Three versus the demons. Yeah. Like I, the I don't like my odds. Yeah, you know what's crazy? I don't know. I feel like that cop is a missing kid, bro. Worship of this deity would include uh, blood sacrifice or the wholesale eating of a child. So you're saying the person that made this symbol is is eating children? Well, that would fit the stories. Now, uh, of course, a few times that this That's symbol the girl, bro. has shown up, From none the of the crimes tree. have been related in any Family. way to any of this. <laughs> bro, I, the thing that's blowing my mind is like, yo, like, yo. I don't know how gangster you think you are. I don't know how much money you think you're gonna make. I don't know what it is that makes you continue this, but yo. I, you gotta go check on your son right now. Yeah, nah, yeah, that's the first place I'm checking. When I'm signing, I'm signing all the books in my book. Oh! oh! Shit! That's a little girl! That's a little girl. Just casually chilling. What the hell? I'll go ahead up with that. I don't care. Yeah, I was up. Uh... Yeah, these little kids are scary. Shit, man. <laughs> y'all let y'all kids do that role, y'all? Right? <laughs> I'm like, I don't even want to see my kid like this, yo. Yeah. Oh, this kid's wide awake. Oh! She drew it! Becoming friends, right? I, I suppose, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I can trust you, right? Let's okay, but look, clearly something far. happened, and you, you want to talk to someone. I'll be honest with you, right? Yeah. Don't tell me. Don't tell me. Okay, don't tell well, me. does your Just wife don't tell me. All right, Wait. after you tell me, I'm telling Joel, and then I'm gonna tell Pat, and we're gonna have everybody with him. Does she know? No, don't tell Who's me about your home things. Nah, I'll tell you about I told Robbie not to tell me, so now that I gotta know, now it's RTTV versus the demons. That's it. I like my odds. So you don't believe in any of that otherworldly stuff, right? Are you kidding me? I believe in all that stuff. <laughs> I, I wouldn't sleep one night in this place. You nuts. Four people were hung by their necks in the tree in your backyard. <laughs> <laughs> God knows where I've ever gotten those. What? Okay. I'm. I'm sorry. 
I'm sorry. You know what? Nice. Right, somebody gotta keep it real with his stupid ass. ass. Who are you talking about? Stephanie. <gasps> Stephanie. Stephanie. Oh, that guy. Yeah. Well, no, the one that's missing. She's Stephanie's the one that's missing, right? Yeah, but he, well, no, it was, it was Jessica. I think. I wasn't sure, but I no, no, no Jessica's definitely the girl. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ashley, go to your room and shut the door. But yeah, Stephanie's there. I was missing. Yeah. Oh, For the open wait, house. saying it didn't happen here? No. It, it happened in the backyard. Oh, that is so so. Oh, God, you think that makes sense? <laughs> no, Ellison, it doesn't. It does. You know, it doesn't. Did it happen here? Shit in the past, but this definitely takes the cake. Nah, nah, nah. if she don't leave that house, if she that's deserves to die. Yeah. Yeah. That's okay. no excuse. Just leave. I wouldn't even be arguing. I'm just out. Oh, like, what are we still talking? So what Trevor drew last week, that happened here. She moved into a house where a family was killed. She found out about the murders, all right? So she felt sorry for the little girl, so she painted up a picture. Nah, nah. That's, that's nah, bro. Like, yo, honestly, bro, yeah, like, yo, this dude's crazy, bro. What else oh, yeah. do you want from me? How about a home where we feel safe, Allison? How about neighbors that don't hate us in a town where I can buy groceries without getting strange looks? Your daddy got daddy in trouble. We wouldn't, we wouldn't be sleeping another night in the house. Bro, that's how I tell you, that woman, they're all crazy, bro. Like, she's crazy for even being with him, bro. Yeah, 10 years of this. And hey, your dumbass couldn't find out if somebody was killing your house. You just did it. She couldn't even do her own research. Mm -hmm. Bro, I'm buying a flight so fast. Bro, I'm taking both kids. Bro, we don't got to take a flight. We keep going in the car and driving. <laughs> keep driving and driving. <laughs> <laughs> bro, then yo, like, I'm out, bro. Anything that happened, he could have been got out, bro. Bro, that's that's the thing that I still I still honestly don't understand. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. Why, do why I have to be in the damn house, bro? Why do you're not even a cop, bro. Go home. I actually have another house I can go to. Bro, you could just stay in the hotel down the street. Bro, bought a bat to a ghost fight. Yeah, my boy bought a bat to the ghost fight, yeah, 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 B. And the cop looked you in the face. A cop looked you in the face and said, yo, I would not even stay like a night in the house. He said, I believe in all that stuff. <laughs> yeah, he said, you don't believe in that, right? Bro, oh, that's right. speech and his, his wife's speech was like the most he needed in his little box. With the kids? He can him? see them? Are they reporting him? Yeah, there's a tape of him. What's that? Who was that on the left? Oh, that's him. Mr. Boogie. Oh. Oh, oh, let's get this shit out of here. That's it. That's it. dog shit out of here. Bro. That's the hell that shit. Get off the house, you idiot. Where is your wife? Where are your children? Nah, bro, but he's just take another bottle of whiskey and make it make sense to himself. I made a mistake. We should have never come to this house. We have to leave now. Oh, well, you're freaking me out here. Get the kids. The wife is a dumb ass bitch. Now he had to leave like this, yo. And now you say, oh, what are you saying? Get out! <laughs> like, my kids, I don't care what my wife says. I'm out. You want to do this? Here, leave. Okay. Stay in the house with you. I'm out with my kids. Okay. They do all this. F you, like. I'll come back with the clothes and all that stuff. Uh, let's go. Uh, F the flow. F everything I have in this. I'm burning this house to the goddamn ground. Well, then, I don't see any reason for me to have you. Yeah, own. like, oh, thanks. This is one more favor. Hold it under sixty till you cross the county line, and do you somebody else's problem. <laughs> yes, sir. Yo, that's a really nice house. I didn't move that's no, that's the old house. That's, that's the house. Day, that's so. the house that uh, Kentucky Blood Boy is at. Yeah, why he trying to get his money back up? Talk. <laughs> so that's why he said, "Yo, once I saw this house and stuff like that, yo, we won't, we won't be eating noodles and noodles." I'm not trying to see his image. No, 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 no. He's like, ah, the scorpion, the scorpion, kill the scorpion. Kill the snake, and the symbol. Wow. I would have never opened it, bro. Early Christians believe that. Bagula actually lived in the images themselves and that they were gateways into his realm. Wow. Gateways? Yes. The ancient church believed that he would take possession of those who saw the images and cause them to do terrible things. Oh, uh, yeah. Like, bro, I am not talking about this shit. Yeah. Bro, I'm good with people like this, bro.
Pick bro, up the yeah, phone. Yeah, like, I don't even get it. Like, what did he do to you now? Like, I'm picking up the phone. What's up, bro? He just scared to even revisit that topic. Yeah, real talk. <laughs> the boxes are in his attic. I'm gonna keep going home with you. I can use one. I would, like, the way the rich one said, I would have just went to a hotel. It's like, give me with everybody in the building. Like, yeah, come do it there, bro. You know what time it is? Yeah, I know. I'm sorry, but I've been trying to call you all day. Mm-hmm. What's the problem? Okay, the problem is that you moved. How is that a problem? I was compiling all of the data that you've had me collecting, and once I started putting it together into a nice readable package, I saw the connection. It was <laughs> obvious. Just like you said, what was it? The dates, the addresses. Each family that you had me look up had previously lived in the house where one of the earlier murders took place. Wow. Listen, Mr. Oswald, you just moved out of the last house in line. If, if this guy is still out there, you not only just sped up his timeline, you put yourself in it. Oh my god. Yeah, that's exactly. And that makes more sense why he was like, with the Stevenson's weird? Nah, because they moved to that crib to get away from the actual crib that was the problem. Yeah, so they thought they were safe. They exactly. No reason to call. Oh, it was a girl. Look at. Uh, you better get your yeah. she's Oh my gosh. My gosh. Yo. Stephanie. And that's what she did in the corner. What the hell? <laughs> If I didn't know when I find out, like I'm just out. I'm yeah. just going like, cause like he put himself like you jeopardize his family because at the end of the day you played with a, you just just like it don't have to be paranormal activities, man. Just the fact that putting your family somewhere where someone died when they leave to go to the school, like you know yeah. what I'm saying. Remember the lady who was like, yo, people are looking at me strange. That's why she didn't even realize. Mm -hmm. Like you live in a freaking but like, and it's crazy like. To like really, real deal, uh, uh, just send your family like psychologically because imagine kids find out all these like kids get scared of the little, little shit. shit. Oh, yeah. I couldn't imagine my year, uh, 
four people were hung in the backyard type stuff and your yeah. daughter like and just to as a father just to be like oh, yeah my, my family can handle that that's crazy as an individual living in that town even if i'm a cop i would just not even want to step foot in the house it's your cop you're just your job bro yeah, I, don't, I don't think you got that. You got that. I didn't say I had a choice. I didn't say I had a choice. I said I didn't. I said I wouldn't want to step foot in the house. Like okay. anytime, you know, anytime, you know. anytime that I would step in that house, I would be scared. I would oh, be trembling yeah. in my boots. Oh, yeah. Like it would, it would be a uh, very, it would be outward, outworldly for me to step in there. Like I think this movie was crazy. Everything from top to bottom was tapped. But I like it just because like it wasn't a happy ending. They weren't able to take out this. They weren't able to take out this evil. Mm-hmm. Like the, okay, the I dude ended up killing them, bro. Yeah, like the dude ended up killing them at the end, and it just shows that. Yeah. Like, it it shows him. that, like he was just that crazy, and he was just that strong. Last real shit though, this dude had to go out of his way to get killed in this movie. Like you, <laughs> he went out his way, bro. bro like, like no bully. Yeah. I like the but I'll tell you one thing though, the plot was creative. Like, I haven't Not watched creative. a movie like that, like the like in terms of how they like. um develop the plot and stuff like that that's what really had me hooked like yo what's the mystery with something about behind these murders and stuff like that what's happening like that was that was really well executed yeah i really enjoyed it um because i think it was really scary because of how disturbing it was Mm -hmm. and i feel like it's also it makes you think like how even watching a movie could be a way of passing on this curse because they they said that this thing was like goes through images just yeah. go through images, you know what I'm saying? So if I later on if I see a scorpion and a snake, I'm gonna be a little worried. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like it, it's on some shit like that, you feel me? Like it, it's almost like the ring, like you watch this tape and then you get a phone call. Like if you're watching the ring and you get a phone call while yeah. watching it, you're gonna think like, yo, hold That's on, like this, this is going something's wrong, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So I feel like I like that kind of uh scariness to, to movies and I think they they hit the nail on the ball. Nah, I feel you because remember in uh the Exit Family Road, she woke up at like 3 a.m. every day. Yeah. I remember I used to be like, yeah, I swear to God. Any time of the night. Yeah. 3 a.m. <laughs> yeah, I wake up at 3 a.m. I'm sure my like, but like, yo, I-, I thought this movie was super dope. Like, once we got like half an hour, and I was like, oh, okay, I just see this shit. And I was like, wow, this is a fire ass movie. And like, um, the one thing I-, I agree with you, Rob, is that the one thing that I think most people do during scary movies, I know I do, is 95% of scary movies, I always think to myself, like, there's no way it could happen to me because there's 50,000 things this person done did. That yeah, I would have been like, ain't no goddamn way it's happening. Mm-hmm. Like, so like, you ain't never gonna catch me in no scary movie because I'm not even gonna make step A, B, C, D, E, F, G before I get to X, and that's when they get murdered. You know what I mean? Because yeah. this dude done made 50 million mistakes in this movie. Like, bro, the fact that yo, you care so much about yo, put this in one of the things themes of the movie yo, yo, chase that shit, go do your thing, but bro, think of your family first. My man was so like engulfed yeah, in chasing that moment. Chasing that like yo, I need to be on TV again. I need to be this guy. I need to make money I need to do all this that yo, he said F their safety If I get this money, I can make everything better. No, you can't clearly and I like how at the end it kind of a lot of times in scary movies They kind of figure it out and then they end up winning at the end and then you just leave the house. And you're all right yeah. This one was like no, bro. You blew it for two hours in this movie the 20 minutes that you did not blow it, yeah. we're not letting you live. Like, so yeah. it was realistic in that way. The damage is already done. That's why the difference between this and Amy Gohar is like, he moved into the crib and didn't know, like, oh, that there's a whole thing behind this. This one is like, bro, you gotta do your research. Bro. <laughs> right. yeah. In that movie, I never watched it. They, they, like, see. they hit it or he just never looked. Nah, uh, they they do because uh, I remember like the house is cheaper because of the fact somebody died in it. And so like, mm-hmm. if I'm not mistaken, but they had like the, I think the home, this Chris Benoit's mansion was like two mil, which they sold it for like two hundred thousand. Oh, That's because yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, people I live there it. still. I believe it. Nah, I would have. I would have. That's a hell of a deal, though. Two million dollar house, two hundred k. Well, I'm gonna move it in there, bro. <laughs> I was gonna ask y'all, yeah, you know that how the little girl killed the parents at the end? Yeah. Your kid gets two milli for doing that scene. Nah, bro. Doing the scene at the end when she killed her she, family. When she chopped the parents in half. She, I, I, she's an actor. Like, my daughter wants to be an actor. Cause, yeah. Bro, that scene, like, when you actually shoot it, it's not like, it's mad like and everything. You know that, right? Yeah, I know. But the fact that your, your daughter got to watch it back and watch, you know what I'm saying? Like, if she she played that role. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. You know, like, my, in that scene, like, she didn't actually kill anybody. Yeah, they didn't show her, yeah, like, like... They didn't show ah! her the action of, like, her actually child. I feel you, but she still was covered in blood. 
You know what I'm saying? She's still. Oh, was she covered in blood or was that just food coloring? No, obviously. It's not <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, My I'm daughter's saying, a professional like, actress, bro. That's not like, that's her dream, but she's going hard. Like, cause I feel like uh, I, that's something you gotta ask. Like, cause what if the difference was six cents? Same thing, kind of. I think the visuals are different, though. That's what I'm saying. You're talking about the way it actually looks. Yeah. But it's the same thing. Because I'm saying, as an actor, like a kid, you that's really where you got to find out if your kid like could tell the difference. Like, would you like let your kid watch this at, that, at her age? But that's what I'm saying. I don't know how kid actors, like, how that their mind I get you. Like, they can even perceive, perceive reality from... Yeah, like, I don't know. Like, I've never been around with, like, that kid that was in success. You feel like, yeah, he knows how to now, tell the difference. He seemed like he was... Mature That's what I'm saying. Like, if my kid is like, I guess it'd be an actor to even be able to do that. Your life has to, to be. Yeah. Because, like, my whole thing is, like, bro, I'm not letting my kid watch this movie at that little girl's age. Because, like, one, it's clearly going to give her nightmares. You're going to see, like, the freaking evil little face thing. But you know how like, kids watch scary movies, like, just by themselves? Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? Like, kids, I we, we were doing, like, everybody's done that, like, watched it on their own. I wasn't watching those. Scary yeah, movies like this at that age, not that age. Nah, nah, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I was like seeing them like when I was like 14, 13. I was like, watching like slashers. It was like, like Michael Myers and like. But Chucky's Chucky. like a demon. It is. He, but Chucky's a doll. Yeah, they, and Chucky's they, just killing that. This is like more. I feel like this is more like in your mind. It's sinister. It's still in that realm though. No, like Chucky's Chucky still in the realm. Of this, it's like possessed. Like it's yeah, voodoo. that's why I was scared of it. It was voodoo. Like they literally did voodoo to. He spirit. died and went into the and body. They put oh, that's, right. yeah. Yeah. that's why I'm like, it's kind of similar to that. It's like a, a doll that's possessed, pretty much like a kid possessed. Not really. I think this one even like it messes even your mind though, up. But it's like even this one, like you gotta see like six kids got killed. They're the ones that went blood all over their faces. I watched Children of the Corner. I don't know what that is. So. That's like it's like it's worse. It's like I this, seen it, yeah. but back then, the kids killing kids yeah. like with corn, like literally the, the way this was disturbed. But like the whole movie, the kids are possessed. But I'm basically saying kids always find a way to like stumble into shit like that. Yeah, not for you. That's a fact. He's saying. I was more like voluntarily. I'm not gonna let my kids. Nah, I think that. nobody would. But like, <laughs> yeah, my parents didn't want me to watch Chucky at all. Yeah, when they, like when I got scared in the middle of the night, I went to their room and was like, "Yo, what did you watch? Like, who told you to watch that?" That's what I'm saying. Like, kids are like, "Don't watch that." I scared. It's your and phone. It's the phone that f's you. Because technically, I could have put parental controls on your TV. But I mean, now you, you got a cell phone. House. Yeah, you got a cell phone. I go my. I go to Joel's house. See it there. Yeah. I can go to my house. house go see it. Means away, yo. But. Dope ass movie. Shit. Fire, fire ass plot right there, man. We'll continue on the Halloween marathon. So if it's your first time, man, death won't be your last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash. That subscribe button, man. It's the one and only Patrick RT. It's your boy Wells. What up, C Boy DC? It's your boy RT. It's a maniac with us underscore RT. And that settles it at the round table. table.